I called you, didn't answer. So I sent a Secret Service agent over to your house. He saw your door was broken. I was worried. Someone tried to kill me tonight. Where? You over here in P613, Cy. There are things I'm not at liberty to discuss or acknowledge on the basis of national security. You know, don't say anything. It doesn't matter anyway. I know who it was, and I know why, and I don't care. Fitz and I are going to be together. I'm sorry, what? I'm going to be with him, Cyrus. We have a plan. It's going to work. I love him. Let me get this straight. Mm. Highly trained black ops assassins broke into your home and tried to kill you. And instead of that, oh, making you run toward reason instead of the possibility of death, making you decide that maybe it's better to be single. You have decided that the killers were merely firing heart-shaped bullets made of bubbles and candy that signified that you and your boyfriend Fitzy are MFEO made for each other? Cyrus, you're being dramatic. Really? Really? I'm being dramatic. I'm being dramatic. I've moved heaven and earth to save you from yourselves. I have lied for you. I have stolen for you. I have cheated for you. I have killed for you. I have almost died for you. And you, you too, are so stupid and romantic and high on your own doomed love, Romeo and Juliet, dear diary nonsense, that you won't even save your own lives. But I am being dramatic. Romeo and Juliet were teenagers and they died. I've had enough. Cyrus. He killed Verna Thornton, Lib. Killed her, dead, with his own two hands. Oh, you didn't know. You were too. I love him and he loves me and our love <gasps> conquers every obstacle in our paths. To find that part out? Whoever told you that? He did. He told me that. The love of your life is a red-handed, cold-blooded killer. That is what you're dealing with. That is who you love. This is not a romance novel. Life is not a romance novel. Turn it off. There's more. I don't care. Turn it off. It goes from room to room and back again. I don't think you want to do this. I'm an old man and I did just have a heart attack. Plus, as far as I can tell, I'm the only grown-up in the room. <laughs>